Hey everybody, it's Friday, June the 24th, and today is going to be a very busy day. Uh, I've got a, a full day of work. Um, Ethan's off writing an exam. The girls are off to school. And then uh, we've got a birthday party number three for Melissa at our uh, her godparents' place. And then after that, we are heading up to Edmonton. So uh, my first meeting of the day today is in Airdrie. The party is on the other side of the city. So I think by the time we get to our hotel room in Edmonton tonight, it will uh, we'll probably be close to a thousand kilometers. So uh, taking the Tesla, because uh, that's the car that can get this job done. Let's go. The car right now is sitting at 399 kilometers, so just over uh, 90, 90 odd percent. It made it to 90 and then I told it to charge this morning while I was getting ready. Um, so that's going to take us through most of the day. When I come back from uh, the Airdrie meeting, I'll probably uh, plug in here at home and charge up. The idea being that uh, it will reduce our charge time at the supercharger in Red Deer because uh, it'll be late and we don't want to be sitting there too long and just kind of want to go straight to Edmonton. So that is the plan. We're starting off our day. I've reset my uh, trip counter B so we can actually see what we get to. And over here, so far on the odometer, uh, we are sitting at 73,185 kilometers on the light runner so far. Beautiful day, 17 degrees out at uh, just after 8 in the morning. All right, made it to my first meeting. I'm going in. All right, two meetings are uh, done in Airdrie here, and it is uh, just about 11.30, getting close to lunchtime. Um, and I am heading back to the home office. Got a bunch of paperwork I gotta get done, and uh, some planning, and then a couple of conference calls this afternoon. Um, I may, actually no, I got it wrong on the amount of um, kilometers I gotta cover today. It's gonna be between five and 600 kilometers, not between 900 and 1,000. I did uh, the math thinking that I'd be going to Edmonton and coming back, but uh, we're just going up. So it's uh, 350 clicks to get there. Uh, it's gonna be 100 here to Airdrie, and then that's it. All right, back in the car, and just a quick look at our uh, range. We're down to 341 kilometers left, and I've got about 50 odd to get me back home um, so yeah sitting uh, pretty good we're gonna charge a bit when we get home so the rest of the day is gonna be an on issue like I said it's only gonna be uh, I thought it was gonna be a thousand kilometers I'm doing today it's only gonna be about 500 to 600 so uh, won't be a problem what I'm trying to do right now is minimize my wait time when we actually get to the supercharger I want to have a lot more range in the battery when we get to the supercharger tonight so that we don't have to wait long in um, Red Deer before we go to Edmonton. All good so far. Just made it home. It's uh, roughly about 12.30, so I uh, got a bit of time for lunch and then um, got a bunch of office work and stuff I need to get done for the uh, end of the day. At the end of the day, we're going to be heading over to a friend's place for a little party for Melissa tonight. Um, I've already traveled about 111 kilometers, and I think to their place is probably going to be oh, a good 40, 45 clicks uh, to get there. And then from there, we're heading up to Edmonton, which is going to be about 350 odd kilometers. So I'm going to plug the car in here at home so that we can get it to pretty much full that way we can go out tonight, make it over to our supercharger in Red Deer, and spend very little time supercharging, 
and then carry on to Edmonton. So we'll see how it works out, but uh, I'm not too worried. We're going to have plenty of range. It's just I want to manage this so that we spend as little amount of time waiting as possible. So while I'm here at home uh, this afternoon, I'm going to be charging. Oh, yeah. So here's what I made it home with, uh, 284 kilometers. And we have traveled a grand total of... 113 kilometers so I'm gonna go uh, plug in right now and we'll top ourselves up probably to just slightly over 400 I think 410 I don't want to go right to 100% because I don't have to but I want to get it to about 90 95% at least so that's where I'm gonna charge to All right, end of day, time to go to birthday party number three. And uh, we're just loading up the car. Kids are almost getting in. I've got the uh, front trunk open. We're loading that up. We're taking everything with us. So we should be underway in about five minutes. So we're up to uh, 391, just over 90%, which is uh, going to be plenty to get us about uh, 200 kilometers between here and our friend's place and then over to the supercharger in Red Deer. How you doing, babe? I'm good, how are you? Are you stressed? School's just about done. <laughs> While the camera was not rolling, I took advantage of yelling at my kids, all of them, not yelling. What? Not me. Well, well not, I guess you did yeah, yell at me a little yeah. bit. It, it was I don't rare. think I missed anybody. I may have missed Samantha. But I've noted her down, so I'll be yelling at her later. Have they yelled at you? Oh, thankfully not. Holy smokes. And cue the rain and the hail. I hope it doesn't hail. Oh, I pray it doesn't hail. Brutal storm coming, though. Brutal storm coming. We're just about there. We're five minutes away and uh, it's been rough because we're in uh, rush hour traffic between, it's actually more than rush hour, it's rush two hours now in Calgary. It's between about 4.30 to quarter to seven. Uh, traffic is really bad. So five minutes and we're there and we're all starving. <laughs> really, really starving. And we're excited to see everybody. Not too. Birthday to you. Two boyfriends. Oh yeah. Everybody had such a good time. They have Hi a... Scott and Nicole and Cassidy and Hey Zoe. Cassidy. And I think from now on, for uh, gifts of any kind, I'm just going to give those big tubs of Nutella. They just bring happiness to everybody. Three kilograms of Nutella worth of happiness. That's like this much. It's a lot. Still uh, early, it's about 11 o'clock, and uh, I think we should get there around 2.30, 3 or something like that, so not too bad. It's only about an hour, hour and a half past our normal Friday Eight. night bedtime. So, next time uh, we see it, we'll probably be at the Red Deer Supercharger. We'll spend a couple of uh, 15 minutes there. I'll... Uh, get some work done and then we'll carry on to Edmonton to our hotel. Well it's 12:30. we just plugged in. We're gonna be here probably for about 15-20 uh, minutes. I'm gonna get some uh, work done on my computer and then we'll continue on to Edmonton. The second part of this trip will be sponsored by Mr. Red Bull. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be <laughs> up all night. Yeah. Yep. 
We're back on the road. We uh, pit stopped there for what about 15 20 minutes. Got a bit of a charge, and uh, it's interesting in Red Deer, the uh, Tesla supercharger is in the parking lot of the Sheraton Hotel, and there's a bar slash nightclub there. Lots of interesting uh, characters out, especially this late at night. And uh, I have just uh, validated what we've always been telling our kids, which is nothing good happens after midnight. In fact, we believe nothing good really happens after 10 p.m. So you see people out that late and uh, nothing good happens. But uh, we are about an hour from uh, Edmonton. Looks like we're going to land at our uh, hotel at 2.32 in the morning, which is, I think, ahead of schedule. I was thinking like 3 o'clock. Um, so we're doing good, letting Tammy do some driving, and uh, I'm just going to kick back and enjoy a Red Bull. Yahoo, we made it. Yay. What a crazy night. Nothing good happens after midnight. All the crazies are out, and they found us. We <laughs> found a crazy here in Edmonton. We found crazies in Red Deer. Yeah. Crazy. I'm just glad to be at the hotel. Crazy's done. Oh, yeah, we're going to bed. And like a 10 minute, 15 minute check in time, the longest check in time ever. Yeah. Um, well, I talked to Crazy. But we are here. So let's uh, check what we made it here with. So we made it with 193 kilometers of uh, rated range left, which of course is tons. And uh, see, Tammy, she drove pretty good, pretty close to the line. With the rain. She always does better than I do. Yay. And it was raining, so let's get our you kids. Lose. Let's get our kids into bed. Sure.